Today we'll be carrying on with the Psych Up Sylveon Don Dozo team and yeah, let's give it a, another whirl. And we're playing something with quite similar Pokemon really. I mean we've got four of the same, so let's um, see what they're running. Sash. So they could be going for something similar obviously but without... Um... Covert Cloakamingus. I don't like that. Drag Knight. Nah, let's just go with the four. I, I, although I guess Amoongus could be a bit of a a pain, but well, we'll be fine. Okay. Great minds. <laughs> In fact, I'm going to tie that. Great minds. Are we winning the same strategy though? <laughs> Let's do this. It's bulky! It's bulky! Are they gonna knock out my Tatsugiri? We're, in, we're so in trouble. We're so in trouble! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! That didn't go well. Although. I'm fire. I'm fire. We're not out of it. We're not doing we're not doing well though. Yeah. Okay. I suppose, right, in this position though, they are probably going to switch in Dondozo, right? So if I switch out and perish song, then their Dondozo's under perish. Or yeah. Have you been having successes with the strap? Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, it's it's tricky. I, I do feel like they're probably going to um, switch on Dozo in. And I guess I could have potentially psyched up, but I'm, I'm under perish. So. Hmm. We call it. We call it, we call it, we call it. The thing is, now... <sighs> right, this is, this is where I have to think, like... Do you attack? <clears throat> I'm not gonna be able to psych up. Actually... Yeah, yeah, I might be able to cycle, actually. Right, do you think they're going to wave crash into Dondozo? They could Earthquake. They could Earthquake. Hmm. Let's just see what they go for. The earthquake. I'm, I'm kind of glad I didn't switch in Sylveon now. <clears throat> that really does nothing. Because, right? I can't believe I'm going to sack off my own my own team here. I've got a plan. So, okay. I could have swapped in on that. Right, because earthquake, earthquake, earthquake. Wave crash. Oh, then again, are oh, they gonna have to double attack on Sylvie on here? If I tear it, oh. right, more than likely, right? They shadow ball plus wave crash into Sylvie on. Now, if I tear a water and psych up, oh no! Whoa! What am I doing? I might be able to survive it. And I guess just uh, wait. Yeah, you know, you know what? We, if I can survive this, we, we might be looking all right. Oh, did you person again? Then again, hey, we might be looking all right, here, guys. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute.
Don't be a Moongus. Don't be a Moongus. Be Iron Hands. Then don't 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 be Iron Hands. Let's see. Be uh, King Gambit. It's a Moongus. Yeah, we lose. Yeah. We tried. I mean, oof. does it really matter? That you did a lot. I'll leave close mount. Yeah, it doesn't really matter anyway. GG. Yeah, unless I crit twice and don't get put to sleep, but nah, we, we've had it. I'm just gonna fall fancy with it. But I'm being so like, yeah, there's no, <laughs> there's no way I'm winning that. One can dream. Anyway, this is an interesting team. You've got Klefki, Dragonite, Salazzle, Baxcalibur. Yeah, I, I guess um, Salazzle and Klefki aren't things you uh, see often. I know um, Alberto Lara was using uh, Klefki quite a lot. Should we do the same thing? Let's just do the same thing. I feel like if I do manage to get it sale, we'll be right, but. Okay. Hmm. What does Klefki do? Thunder Wave, Screams, Trick Room, Draining Kiss. Okay, don't mind that too much. White screen, okay. Yeah, I thought it might be something like that. I should live. Hmm. I'll just swap it in. I know we'll probably ferry some well. Oh, I shouldn't have swapped in, should I? I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm not playing. I, 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 yeah, they just parry. No. Oh. Wait, would you? Why, why would you not parry some there, right? Do you know Perry somewhere? Well, actually, if I get rid of Fluttermane, then. If I get rid of Fluttermane, we're not looking too bad. Because I can psych up. Excalibur. Okay, they didn't Perry Song. Why would they not Perry Song? Hmm. That's very interesting. If you, cause you should really, uh, I mean, they could, if they just parry song, my, my Don Dozo, then he's on the counter. It's Roaring Moon. It's gonna, um, probably throat chop me, which is not ideal. Should I try a steal? Poison. Not ideal. Yep, they do throw chop me, that's fine. That's fine. That's doing a lot. No, it's not. No, it's fine. It's absolutely fine. Yes. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Uh, I'm just going to double protect here. This is so funny. <laughs> this is such a funny strategy. I love it. If you can pull it off, it's really satisfying. I can't hyper voice though, which is... <laughs> Which is not, a, yeah, they do just protect, that's fine. <sighs> okay, so if I wave crash, they can wave crash with KO. And Terror Blast, we should be right. We're going to Klefki, that's fine. Obviously, doesn't do a lot. That, ooh, not enough. This is going to prop my berry, which is really nice. Thank you very much, I will be eating my berry berry. Okay. And I still have Fluttermane left. I can hyper voice now. Not that obviously it's going to do a lot to Klefki or anything, but I do just want to... Okay. Trick room? No, just on the way. That's fine. Actually, that, 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 that did do a lot. It's uh, more than I thought.
They probably, I mean, you've not got light screen anymore and I just want to get rid of Clef Key off because I do have Dazzling Gleam on uh, Fluttermane so that should just uh, finish it off. And my opponent has left so... Does that mean we win? Oh, come back. Please, please opponent, we were doing so well. I wanted to see how it ended. Because there's always like, you never know. Nah, no, we win. I would have liked to finish that, but never mind. Never mind. But that worked pretty well. Okay. Same thing? Let's do it. Did play Corbin out before, didn't we? See what they've got. <laughs> Leftovers, Tailwind, Body Crest stuff, okay. No um, bulk up though or anything, Iron Defense stuff, that's good. Great Tusky's Life, Orb, Trace Band Dragonite, yeah. Mental Herb Amoongus with Foul Play. That's interesting. And Haze Palafin, right. Well, at least we know it's Haze. So they've got a lot of text here for, um... Yeah, maybe I shouldn't run it then. Let me... I'm, I'm just... I know they've got a lot of text around on Dozo here, so... I mean, they've got... <coughs> Foul play would do a lot. These two are just going to hit like trucks. They've got the Haze, and they've got Will-O-Wisp, so... But... Actually, let's, should we do something different then? Should we go Dragon Eye? Let's, 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 let's do something different. Let's do something completely different. Yeah, it, this is going to be like, it depends what they get into position at whatever time. It's going to be kind of a a positional game. Obviously, they're taking the time to think about it, which is fair enough. Kind of excited to use the Dragon Eye. I'm just thinking, like, otherwise, Amoongus is going to be an issue. Okay. Okay. I wonder how much... Fire Punch does to um, Porvenite. I mean, he's gonna, he should do a lot. What is my cat doing? What is she doing on there? She's not that cat. Ooh, that did a lot. <laughs> I get mirror, arm, mirror armored against myself. Who are you going to bring in? I don't know, uh, did they have flip turn? No. I'm just going to stay in. They're going to their own Dragon Eye. Body press is fine. That's fine. Accuracy drop? Nope. Okay. Well, we're not, we're not in the worst position. Although... Great Tusk comes in. Okay. What did the Great Tusk have? It was Life Orb, Headlong Rush, Close Combat, Earthquake. Do I now go for the Dondozo stuff? Or do I just double switch?
No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, yeah, because extreme speed will take me out. And they're, they're gonna go into Palatine, obviously, but it's kind of fine because, yeah, no worries there. Oh no! That's annoying. Ah, oh, that's really annoying. You just take swings for you, don't you? Oh no, they're locked into Outrage, aren't they? Oh, actually, actually... I'm gonna be faster here. Does, um... Let me just try and get rid of Palfin. Yep. Wait, do doesn't knock me out. That doesn't do a lot. That does. Oh man, this is uh, this is tense. I need to swap out to, uh, Tatsugiri because of um, I don't want to take um, I don't want to miss icy wind or muddy water when I need to. Although outrage is going to do a heck of a chunk. Okay, oh, let's go, Dragonite. No! I feel like that one... Oh, why did that do so much damage? <laughs> Crit didn't matter. I don't... Um, I don't know. I'm not convinced on that one. It might be choice by stab, but still... I think Great Tusk protects here. Because, I mean, Muddy Water should knock it out. Dragonite is locked into Outrage, though. Oh, man, this is going to be close. Hmm. I, just, I, I, I need to get some chip on that Dragonite. I feel like Great Tusk protects. It's probably, it's, it'll be faster anyway, but never mind. Right, we've got one out, and that's that for some reason Great Tusk is slower than Tatsugiri, and we Dragonite keeps hurting itself. Oh! It was faster than y'all, but... Ah! <laughs> well, that, that, we, that was kind of close in the end, it could have been. Um, yeah. I mean, if it hurt, it, if the Dragonite hurt itself there, and um, it, in fact, if the Dragonite did hurt itself there, or yeah, then I probably would have won because I could, as long as Draco Me here got it, we would have uh, that should have knocked out her. Uh, so yeah, that was a good game. Um, I am actually going to leave it here for today's episode. A bit of a shorter one because um, I've got things to do sadly, but um, yeah, this team is pretty cool. Um, I suppose it was kind of nice bringing the Dragonite in that last game. It's something a bit different. So, uh, yeah, I don't know if I'll play it next time. Might change to something else, but um, it's definitely a cool strategy. Um, we did get to, you know, pull off the Sylveon Cycle trick a couple of times. Obviously, you can probably tell Don Dozo is not really something <laughs> I'm comfortable using. Obviously, yeah, it's uh, there's definitely, a, as much as it's like a oh, easy Don Dozo setup, there is definitely a skill to it because you've got really, it's all about, you've got to position yourself really well to, uh, to kind of pull off that strategy, so. Yeah, interesting. Cheers for watching, guys. Take it easy, and I'll see you all in a bit.